Introducing the Paddy Power World Dance Championships. Richard, huge congratulations, an incredible performance there. Just try and put that into words. Yeah, it's amazing, huh? nine legs in a row against Kim Huybrecht. Yeah, I'm always dreaming about that, but it's always tough cool games against Kim. The whole pro tour I played three or four times against him, and it's always close, 6-5. He missed some doubles, I win, so... But now, yeah, my scoring was very good, and my doubles as well, so, yeah. The first round was quite a nervy affair, but you looked so much more comfortable up on the stage today. How much confidence did you take from that first round win? Yeah. Of course, I won so much the first round win, and now I was thinking everything is bonus now, so keep enjo enjoying the stage and do what you're going to do, so that's what I did. And we saw you beat the world champion Michael Smith in Minehead last month. Do you, do you feel that's the best performance you've produced on the big stage in the PDC? Yeah, I think it is, against the world number one, so you're impressed about him. And, but now this was, I think, my second uh, against Kim, with nine in a row on the Connelly Pally, so yeah. And up next for you it's Michael Van Gerwen, an all-Dutch affair. Just yeah. how big an occasion will that be back home in the Netherlands? I think it's not a big uh, occasion, no. He's the favourite, he's a very good player and yeah, I'm enjoying it and see what I can do. And although Michael will be the favourite, if you can produce a performance like that in the next round, do you believe you can cause a big upset? Maybe I can take a set then. Yeah. Thanks Richard, thank you. Richard, congratulations, that's two brilliant performances now at Alexandra Palace. Are you growing in confidence all the time you're on that famous stage? Yeah, I think it is. I think it's, it's still learning and the only way you got to do is playing so much time on that stage, so it's going to be usual. And my second, my first time I played there, I was a little bit nervous, and now I definitely want to get that win over the line. And but yeah, after that it is bonus, and I'm enjoying it, and the crowd is is amazing. So yeah. We saw you for many years in the BDO and WDF circuit before you made the switch. How would you assess your time in the PDC so far? I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's, uh, it's 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 a lot of time going to the PDC because I'm working still 40 hours a week, and it's tough, but uh, I'm enjoying it. And my my level is going up when you, when you're playing good players every time. So yeah, it's tough, but I'm enjoying it, and yeah, I love every minute of it. The better you're becoming, the better results you're getting. Are you close to making darts a full-time job then, perhaps? Yeah, let's see what we can do. But first time. Is uh, my boss is very helpful with me, so we are very busy. So <laughs> they, they can't miss me. Uh, yeah, everybody's missable, but it's very busy. So I'm going back to work uh, in January for a couple of weeks. So no, we we'll see. I'll definitely go for a week, uh, another year for work, and we'll see how it goes on the PDC tour. Richard, many congratulations. Thank you. Richard, how much are you looking forward to that game with Michael Van Gogh in a really big occasion? Yeah. I don't see it as a big occasion. I, I, I love playing that stage and it's third round and Michael van Gerwen, what, what do you want? So I'm, I'm going to enjoy it and I, hopefully I play my best dart. So. No extra nerves? No, not at all. No, not at all. No. Okay. Richard, you mentioned that you're still working 40 hours a week. We know that next year all of the Pro Tours are midweek. Is yeah. that going to affect you with work? Um, no, not at the time. No, I got a good boss who's helping me with with my free time. So, yeah. And third round of the World Championship now. We know the experience you have in the BDO World Championship, two semi-final appearances. Yeah. How much has that experience on that stage helped you on the big BDC stage? It's always good when you're playing on stage. You you can see and learn how the crowd is, and but this is something special here in Ali Pali with the crowd. So. You can't do that of learning it at home, how it feels like here. You have to stand here and hopefully you stand here many more times, so it's going to be usual to play here. So. And after your first year in the PDC, how would you assess your 2023? Yeah, it's, it's a very good year for me. I'm, after GN, I'm the best player for who's getting a tool card this year, so yeah, and I'm, I'm enjoying it and my darts are going well, so yeah. 
Big well done, Richard. Thank you. Thank you. Richard, is it difficult sometimes to play a player who's struggling, especially with the checkouts in that situation? Um, you seem to up your game even when he was dropping away. I'm enjoying it when he's missing, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, if he's, if he's hitting all the doubles, then you're thinking, oh, I've got a problem then. But after he's missing so many doubles, or so many, but luckily I, I hit my doubles straight well, so yeah. And I know you said maybe get a, get a, a set off Michael, but how do you go about preparing for Michael Van Gogh and somebody you know so well? Yeah. How do you prepare, prepare for Michael Van Gogh? He's yeah. the best player in the world, so I'm enjoying it and I'm going to do my best as I can, so we'll see. Introducing the Paddy Power World Dance Championships. Hey!